Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a much requested, unfiltered, unedited day in my life. If you guys are new to these videos, I quite literally turn on the camera throughout the day and go home, I am home, <laughs> and then at the end of the day I put all the clips together and literally upload it. No edits, like it's kind of scary because you guys just see the real me. No, I'm kidding. It's the same. It's just like there's pauses and there's awkward moments and that's life. So I do like doing these sometimes. And um, yeah, I literally just woke up as you can tell by my voice. Um, it's 8.43 a.m. It's Friday. Ryan and I did Christmas last night because we don't spend the holidays together. Um, just right now. That doesn't make sense. See, I can't edit this out. Ha ha ha. Um, we, I don't know, like both of our families want to see us. At, oh my God. This is a mess already, you guys. But he got me, he came and brought these roses. And then also he got me a heart locket, a 14 karat gold heart locket. And I put it on this one because this is 13, which represents my dad and my brother because they were both born on the 13th. And that's my brother's soccer number as well. So I thought all the men in my life <laughs> on this little necklace so very sweet very thoughtful of him i am so excited for a cup of coffee i won't say cuppa anymore because apparently oh my gosh i look phenomenal right now because apparently cuppa means tea which makes sense because i've only ever heard my grandma say cuppa and it was always about tea so that makes sense um so I'm gonna have a cup of coffee. Um, Ryan, it's Friday, so if you guys remember from my Vlogmas, um, Fridays Ryan does this like intense egg flip. Um, he does an egg flip every morning on his like private Snapchat story, which I'm telling him to put it online because it's freaking hilarious. Um, it's kind of like it's a bones day or a nose bones day if Ryan makes his egg flip. But on Fridays he does like an intense one and he couldn't decide what to do this morning. He slept over so I was like trying to like give him ideas before he left and my idea, he's gonna do it on the crosswalk and he's like, I don't know, it's a long way to take an egg because you have to, sorry my machine is so loud. He was like, you have to take it down the elevator and you gotta keep the egg hot and the egg doesn't flip as well if it's not hot. I was dying laughing because he like knows. I'm so sorry for the high exposure. Um, but yeah, I just thought that was so funny. So he's going to take it to the um, crosswalk and like flip it on the sidewalk or the crosswalk. I don't know. It's just something different, you know? I'm wearing these PJs. They're from the brand Lunia and I never want to take them off. They're so comfy. They are flannel PJs, so they're great for this time of year, even though it's uh, 57 degrees outside, so <laughs> it's really not that cold. Um, anyways, I'm gonna put this camera down for a second while I do some things. This looks phenomenal. I love this cup of coffee because I had it in my college apartment too, and it just represents like so many great memories of sitting in my living room with Delaney, my old roommate at Georgia, and like vibing out. Um, so I'm glad I brought it with me. Um, yay. Okay, so I've got my eye patches on. I threw my hair back because it was annoying me. But I wore the eye patches with the big tips or the small tips in just for you guys. I know that it's supposed to go this way, but sometimes I like how it feels when the bigger end is on the inside. I don't know why. It's in a weird way more refreshing. Um, so it's Friday morning. Every Friday morning I post polls on the Gals on the Go Instagram that relate to the episode. And, um, so that's what I'm going to do this morning. That's kind of like my Friday morning activity. Um, I'm posting a campaign for Wilson today, which I am so excited about because it's such a cool brand and I was so excited that they wanted to work with me. Let me see if I can show you guys the photo because I just thought it was very... I don't know. I just felt really cool. Like, such a vibe. Their clothes are so cool. I got this varsity jacket from them. And this really cool, like, set. 
was just a really fun time. So I'm posting that today. And then tomorrow I'm heading home for the holidays. So I'm excited about that. So I have to pack today. I think, I don't know if I'm gonna bring two suitcases or if I'm gonna bring one suitcase and pack like this like huge tote bag that I brought on the Allure staycation, if you guys saw that. Um, because I know I'm just gonna bring stuff back, I feel like. Um, and all the gifts I got for people, I ended up shipping to my house just because I wanted, I don't know. I don't wanna like have to travel with it all. And I ended up like shopping in person here and then like ordering it at the store to go home or I'd like see something in person, which is always fine. You can touch it, it's tangible. And then I came home and I'd be like, oh, I'm gonna order that now. Sorry if I'm not making much sense. I did just wake up. I need a sip of coffee, hold on. Uh, remember in college I would I would do the um the first sip bit. Well it wasn't a bit, but I would always be like, okay, it's time for the first sip. It's seriously magical. Like I don't know, I feel like a lot of people my age love iced coffee and that's like the only kind of coffee they drink and I like iced coffee, but I love a hot cup of coffee in the morning. It's kind of my preference. Um just because it like gets me started for the day, gets things moving. I don't know, it just and like when you wake up, your voice is kind of like all over the place. So it's nice to soothe it up a little bit with some hot cup of coffee. So nice. Anyways, I'm being really dramatic right now. See you guys in a bit. <laughs> I just put this little fireplace on. I always just go on YouTube and look up fireplace and choose a different one each day. I do like this one though. It's like 10 hours Yule log fireplace. But this one, I like how it had the stone around it. I feel like I'm at a ski lodge, <laughs> even though I'm fully, fully not. <laughs> Ryan egg flip time. Gotta keep the pan nice and hot. Are we going to the street? Yep, guess so. All right. <laughs> it's on the loose. We did it. <laughs> that was awesome. That's gonna be a fan favorite. Okay, I am back home now from helping Ryan with his egg flip. It went off without a hitch. I am now, um, I just posted the, the Wilson photo, and now I'm gonna do the Gals on the Go polls. So what I do is we have this like backdrop we use. Um, for My fireplace is crackling so hard. It's so beautiful, Emma made it for us. Speaking of Emma, our graphic designer, we took her to brunch yesterday. She got us little gifts which she did not have to do. We obviously got her a gift, but oh my gosh, so sweet. She got us a couple things, but one of the things she got us is this Le Labo um, hand pomade. You guys know how much I love Le Labo Santal scent, but she got us this Hinoki scent, H-I-N-O-K-I. -I. This hand lotion smells actually unreal. I was like, Emma, now I love this scent from Le Labo. I mean, it makes sense that they would have multiple really lovely scents. Mmm, it smells like a spa. I literally am obsessed. Um, but anyways, go follow at Gals on the Go podcast if you don't already. Um, but the polls this week are, have you ever been disappointed from a celebrity encounter? Are you still watching Vlogmas? Is NYC the new LA? Do you typically enjoy New Year's or New Year's Eve night? Um, oh, I think that means like, do you typically enjoy New Year's Eve? And have you listened to this week's episode? So I'm gonna post those now. And it's so crazy that I'm not doing Vlogmas, but we're still connected. See, here I am, and literally, and yesterday, yesterday when I was with Brooke all day, she was doing Vlogmas. So if you just want to see what I did yesterday, it's fully on her channel because I was with her pretty much the whole day. So um, I'm gonna post these polls now. But I was just in a chatty mood. The caffeine's hitting. Okay. The best breakfast there is out there, and no cap. <laughs> Good morning. All right, guys, we are taking a ginger shot. I'm about to hop on a couple calls back to back, and I want to be nice and energized. Oh my gosh, the lighting is terrible, but I can't edit it. All right, cheers, guys. I'm on the phone with Brooke. Too. Hello. <laughs> cheers. Oh, here we go. Ah, oh, that feels great. Ho, ho, he, he. Dang, okay, bye guys. It is time to wash this hair. She is greasy, she is oily, she is everything we don't want right now. 
Um, I'm gonna take another the shower. It's the best kind of shower. It's the most Supreme kind of shower. I already showed you guys what's in my shower before but I think today um, We're gonna do the biolage shampoo and conditioner. I love this stuff a lot. My hair always smells so good after um, and I'm still loving this Lalabo body wash. It's incredible. And this Byredo Rose body wash is amazing too. I'm really just into scents right now. It's kind of this random thing about me. I used this last night before I went to bed and my skin feels so soft. It's the Elemis Superfood Midnight Facial. So we're going to take a shower. I'm just loving today. I love being in my apartment. I've never been somewhere like this, but ever since I moved to New York, I think I've just curated such a safe space for me, and I just, I'm so happy in my apartment, <laughs> so I'm just enjoying it, and I have to pack, and like, this is my last alone time for a little before I go home with my family, so. Okay, I just got out of the shower. I have my hair in like a towel scrunchie. Seriously, a lifesaver. Um, I feel like I've been showing my skincare a lot, but I am like obsessed with skincare right now. Um, so we're going to use the Sunday Riley CEO Brightening Serum. You guys have all been complimenting my skin lately. And that's like one of the best compliments ever. I've also been drinking so much water. So maybe that has to do with it. I like wake up and chug water. Um, and it's crazy how much it affects your day. And I'm using the Sunday Riley Auto Correct um, under eye cream. This is like from the Morning Buzz Kit. And I literally love it. There's caffeine in this eye cream. I'm just like into skincare right now. Like, this is something I always get into in the winter, which is weird because I feel like it would be the summer, but I just love during the winter having super clear skin, putting my hair in a claw clip and a sweatsuit and calling it a day. I don't know, is that just me? <laughs> um, and this Malin and Goetz Mojito Lip Balm. Love that for me. I'm about to hop on a Zoom call in one minute with my manager, Brooke's manager, and Brooke about some exciting stuff for Gals on the Go, hopefully for 2022. And we're locking down our merch. We're doing a merch drop in February. That's all I'm gonna say, and I'm already obsessed with it. Um, so just like a little chat before we um, are all like not working as much for the holidays. For the holidays. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna do this call. Also, I've been wearing this robe non-stop. It's like a towel robe and it's long and it's warm. I don't know where it's from, but I got it on a brand thing. So, anyways, this is so funny. I just some ramp this video is gonna probably be an hour long. I hope you all enjoy. Hello, calls went well. Um, just showered, washed my hair, letting it air dry. Tank top is parallel apparel. Biker shorts are from Pure Velo the line. I am, I got a couple juices from Pressed Juicery yesterday. My favorite juice from them is the, I'm like, OG YouTuber, the Greens 3. It, this is what it has in it. I'm not going to read all this for you guys, but um, if it focuses, because I can't edit this out. There we go. I love a green juice that has apple in it and ginger, because the apple will make it a little bit sweeter. Cheers. <laughs> Oh, uh, it's just like you're drinking it and your body's like, thank you. <laughs> mm. Um, all right, first things first, we got to do laundry. So, um, I try to be responsible and do like my lights and darks. It's really hard, but I'm going to dedicate the day to doing this. So we're going to actually do lights and darks. Because sometimes I'll do like all the colors together, but put it on a cold wash. They say that helps more. I don't know. So right now I've got a couple towels in there. So I'm going to add some like white things. This laundry thing is from Serena and Lily, by the way. A lot of people have been asking. A lot of people have been asking. <laughs> um, I feel like most of my things are colored. Oh, this is white. We'll throw this in there. Um, what else do we have? White socks. So yeah, I'm just gonna put this first load in. Um, this is, these are the two laundry detergents I've been using. <laughs> um, this stuff, powerhouse. It also smells amazing. It's the OxyClean Clean Meadow. I've heard fresh scent is really nice, but it was literally sold out everywhere. 
And then I also obviously love the Le Labo Laundress Santal 33. But there's not a lot of it. But one of you said to buy like, I guess there's un, I mean there's definitely unscented laundry detergent and put this, sorry I'm like burping, it's so gross. Um, put this, like a little bit of this with the unscented so you still get the scent but like you're not wasting a ton of it because I mean look I've already used so much. So since I'm doing a lot of washes I'm going to do this but in the new year I'm going to try and get some unscented laundry detergent to do that. But yeah so I'm going to do that, get the first load in, let's do it. All right, I'm about to change my sheets. These are fresh sheets, but they were like up in my like laundry area. My fireplace is still going. Um, so I sprayed some of the Le Labo Santal uh, 26 spray and then threw it in the dryer. And they smell so good and they're so warm. So I'm going to remake my bed and just have it all nice and fresh here. And uh, I just talked to Ryan. And I think we're gonna get lunch together and eat it on my roof. That's the update. Gosh. If you guys are still watching this, props to you. Look how satisfying that looks. Like some freshly washed sheets. Wow. Incredible. I just had to share this with you guys. Just got Uber Eats from this place, Marafuku Ramen. I've gotten it um, from there before. Brooke and I were on the phone earlier and we were both like, I really want ramen right now. So she was ordering some on Uber Eats and I was like, I'm totally gonna do that later. <laughs> I love ramen. I do not know why, but it's so good. So I got some for Ryan and I. He's gonna come over. We're gonna go to my roof and eat it. So we get a little fresh air and some soup. Good soup. <laughs> um, oh, I'm in the best mood. It's like the best and you just don't have to be anywhere. Just chill out. Literally the sun's already like on its way down. It's 310. Love that. Ryan's here right now. This yep. one um, got a little spilt. Mm -hmm. So we're rationing up <laughs> splitting this between the two of us. We both got the chicken ramen. Got a great view though, can't complain. Vibes are right. <laughs> New York, baby. A little package time. My Barefoot Dreams um, robe just came in the mail that I exchanged from Our Secret Santa. I got a size large in the color Dove Gray. I am so excited to put this on my body. Wow. I got a refill of the Pura um, Apothique White Vetiver scent. It's that thing I have over there that produces scent throughout my whole apartment. I love it. So I got two more. I think I'm on some subscription service actually, so I don't really know. And then DW Home Candles sent me a holiday spice. It smells incredible. I'm about to light it because I like a thousand candles lit at once. And it's almost like they watch my vlogs or read my comments or something because everyone's telling me I need to start cutting my wicks. Um, so they sent me a wick cutter too, which I thought was hilarious, but also very helpful. So yeah, just thought I'd give you guys a little mail, mail time, mail haul. Um, I think I'm in heaven right now. I'm so glad I got the large because it's so long and cozy. I have to send Margo a picture. This is so nice because I always walk around my apartment. You guys have seen in my vlogs where I have the blanket, the Barefoot Dreams blanket wrapped around me and I'm like walking around and then it falls and everything. But this, it's literally tied around you. Oh, BRB never taking this off. Like literally, I mean, this is a gown. Should I make it fashionable? <laughs> oh, everyone got to go to the rehearsal dinner? Even cooler. Love that for them. Okay guys, it's, Actually, it's not a lot later. It just got dark outside. It's only like six o'clock. Um, I've spent the last hour on the phone with like so many different friends just catching up. I don't know. Whenever I pack, I like to talk to people on the phone. So Delaney and I talked for literally an hour. We have not talked in so long. So there was just so much to catch up on. I did a face mask. As you guys saw, I've got everything on my bed right now. I'm packing really randomly for home because I kind of overpacked last time and I ended up just dressing more comfy. It is actually supposed to be a little chilly at home. By chilly, I mean like high of 60, which is that, that's pretty chilly for Florida. Um, so that means there'll be chilly mornings, but I'm just bringing like a ton of long sleeve crop tops. It's been my vibe lately. Some flare leggings, a little, some workout stuff if, if I get to that. Um, some tanks and tees, a pair of pajamas. What else? This is like a leather wrap dress. I don't have any plans for when I go home. 
so i just like i'm not bringing a ton of like really really cute outfits um and then i have these two dresses like a t-shirt dress and a rib dress leather shorts all oh and i'm obviously gonna get some jeans out of there this is my like cool set that could be fun to wear i literally i i hate packing i don't know and then i thought i'd throw this in because it's pretty and festive i can maybe wear it on christmas we just always do christmas at my house um again nothing really crazy so packing is kind of random right now um but i'm just throwing things in i just don't have the energy to like be like this day this outfit but i'm thankful that's what i love about going home i just decompress oh i need to pack sweat sets for sure um, I just want to hang out with Finley. Like, literally, that's all I want to do. So, <laughs> and I do have to do a little bit more holiday shopping when I'm home as well. And wrap gifts. It'll be really cute. But, yeah. That's what's going on. Ooh, ooh. I just really tripped on my shoes. And you guys witnessed that. I've got some things air drying on my ladder. Um, and then I do need to put my top sheets and my duvet back on. So, and I'm literally thriving in this robe. Ryan and I kind of want to do something tonight, but, like, don't really want to know what to do. I don't know. Might just go for a walk and, like, make dinner. I really don't know. All right, you guys. Um, it's 8 o'clock now. I pretty much finished packing. You know I'm being lazy when I don't use packing cubes. Like, I literally just put random stuff in my suitcase. And my flight's not till, like, 3.45 tomorrow, so I've got some time in the morning to finalize everything before I leave. But... I just spit. Um, <laughs> being really weird today. I decided to put on a little bit of makeup. I just did like my no makeup makeup look that I did in Vlogmas Day. I think it was the last day, Vlogmas Day 15. Um, and I tried to fix my hair a little bit. Ryan and I are gonna go for a walk and like maybe grab dinner or grab takeout or something. I don't really know. And then come back and watch a Christmas movie. We always have high expectations for our evenings. I'm like, okay, I always wanna go to my roof and sit up by the fire because there's like a little fire up there. Um, and I've been talking about making spiked hot cocoa. And then when we get back, we're always in like a food coma or we're tired or we're just lazy. So hopefully that actually happens tonight. We shall see. Um, but just chill vibes tonight before I head home. I'm so excited to go home and just relax. It's going to be so fun. Um, I'll show you guys my outfit. It's nothing crazy. It's nothing fancy. Just warning you all. Um, this is the fit. This is the look. Um, I'm wearing my gals on the go. On the go. Gray hoodie. New York, New York. I love it. It's still on sale. Galsonthegopodcast.com. It's so comfortable and just easy to layer with things. Um, why is the lighting just not amazing? Um, and then puffer is from Aritzia. And then I'm wearing some Spanx faux leather leggings. And then my white Air Force Ones and crew socks. It says it's 52 degrees outside, but I'm learning that in New York, 52 degrees is not the same as down, down south. So it's gonna be, I feel like it's gonna be a little chilly. And guys, Ryan likes the coat I got for him for Christmas. I got this long gray coat and I'm really hoping he's gonna be wearing it tonight, but it's a little bit nicer. So he might not be wearing it. He might be wearing his car hard, but we shall see. It's Ryan and I's last night together because I head home for the holidays, obviously. Um, so I'm looking forward to it. And yeah, that's the gist. Hello from Ryan's apartment. We're here now. We just grabbed some burgers and french fries. It was delicious. And now we're at his apartment. We're gonna chill out on his um, little outdoor patio area. He's turning on all the lights right now. Um, but yeah, you kind of have to hop through this window in order to get out. Guys, he's wearing the coat. <laughs> oh my God, I love it. Update, the plants are still doing well because it's literally like not cold here. Um, well, this one falls a lot and that just happens. That one, yeah, that one gave us lots of splinters. Oh my gosh, I forgot about the signs. So more cute. Signs. You want more signs? Oh, yeah. More signs, more signs. Yeah, it's a really nice night. It's not too cold. Good vibes to just sit and chill and talk about life. <laughs> I spy Ryan. <laughs> Ryan just helped me make my bed. So sweet. 
We are about to watch a Christmas movie. Yep. And I think we decided on Jingle All the Way. It's with Arnold Schwarzenegger. It's really funny. All right, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. I feel like it was probably an hour long. Um, yeah, you have to see what streaming service it's on. I forget. You can like search it on the remote. Um, yeah, we're just gonna chill out, watch a movie, and yeah, I leave it to whoa <laughs> HBO Max. Um, I leave tomorrow, and yeah, you guys are. This is your. This is our last time seeing you in the Santa hat. Oh, what's that? I know. The Santa hat will be back though. So you first. December. Oh, is that so? You don't do it after Thanksgiving. It's December first. I guess I'm sorry. Yeah. December first. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Starting Thanksgiving. That's like a really long time to wear Santa. Unless it's Jordan. Okay. Cute. 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 Oh, all right. Subscribe, you guys. Let me know if you like this format of video. I know typically you guys do like it. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys very soon for our next video. And I love you guys. Mwah. Goodbye, New York, for now.